Welcome to Tinkernut.com's video cast. In this video I'm going to show you three ways to edit PDF files. This is going to use three different programs. The first one uh, is called Fox at Reader. It's kind of like Adobe Acrobat and it's so that we can read the files. The second one is called Cute PDF it's so that we can write PDF files. And the third one so that we can actually edit the files is called PDF to Doc. Alright, so the first step we're going to want to do, of course, is install Foxit. And uh, to do that, just go to http colon slash slash www.foxitsoftware.com and download and install it. And then once it's installed, it's going to operate exactly like Adobe Acrobat. This is just a, a more lightweight version um, and a little bit faster version than Adobe Acrobat. Alright, the second thing we need to do is install Qt PDF and that's at www.arcosoftware.com. So just go ahead and download and install it. And uh, whenever it installs, just open up a Word document, any Word document, or any document actually that can print. And uh, uh, just go to print and select Qt PDF Writer. And then click OK it's going to ask you where you want to save it and uh, you can just select anywhere but it's going to save it as a PDF file so any document that you can print you can actually save as a PDF file so this is the PDF version alright the third thing we're going to want to do is uh, download PDF to doc and that's at hellopdf.com so uh, just go ahead and go to that website and download it and then install it. And then once you finish it, um, it's going to automatically launch the program. And all you have to do here is actually browse to any PDF file and open it. And then it's going to ask you where you want to save the doc version of it or the Word version of it. And then just click the convert button and it will automatically open up the converted version in Microsoft Word so that you can edit it and then use Qt PDF to write it back to a PDF file. And if you want to edit your PDF files online, a really cool website is called pdfhammer.com. It doesn't actually let you edit the text, but you can uh, you can combine PDF files together and move the pages around and things like that. So uh, all you'd have to do for that is just kind of give you an, an example is open up a, a PDF file, just click upload, and you're going to see pictures of the pages below. And then, uh, you know, if you want to uh, incorporate another PDF file into it, just upload it, and, and you'll have uh, two different PDF files, and what you can do from here is preview each of the pages, uh, see see what's on them, and then by clusters you can select them and either move them to the end or move them to the beginning, just kind of uh, shuffle them around. And then at the very bottom there's a button where you can actually, whenever you're through editing it, uh, save it as another PDF file. So you can export it as a PDF. So uh, it's a pretty cool little little website, and um, again, that's free. But uh, for now, that's it for this tutorial. For more, go to Tinkernut.com.